dies, the Supreme Court overrules appeal court, affirms NNPP Abba Kabiris UC as Kanu governor. And these have generated a lot of reactions from Nigerians. Hello everyone, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. The Supreme Court has aff affirmed the election of Governor Ahaba Kabiri of Kanu State, thereby revising his sacking by the Happy Court. The court returned 165,000 votes to the governor. In September 2023, the election petition tribunal in the state deducted 165,663 votes from UCIF total number of votes and declared them as invalid. The tribunal said it was satisfied that the ballot papers of the affected votes were not stamped or signed. INEC had declared that Yusuf received 1,019,602 votes to defeat Nasaru Gawana, who had 809,705 votes. The election petition tribunal in the, in the state nullified the victory of Yusuf. Therefore, the new Nigerian People's Party NNPP candidates in the March 18th governorship election. In turn, the tribunal affirmed Nasiru Gawona of the All Progressive Congress APC as the duly elected governor of the state. The tribunal ruling was upheld by the Court of Appeal in November 2023, saying Yusuf was not qualified to contest the election. The governor proceeded to the Supreme Court to seek redress. Gauna had also questioned the NNPP membership of Yusuf, arguing that the party should not have sponsored his election for the uh, election, okay, for the party. But the Appeals Court held that the tribunal never held that Governor Yusuf was not qualified to view for election as endlessly held by the Court of Appeal. The court described the issue of nomination as exclusively the internal affairs of a political party, therefore not justifiable. Okay. Um, congratulations to him. <laughs> he, these people saw this coming they know that if they do if they do otherwise if they do otherwise they are going to set this country on fire and they start so they, they just have to do the needful if you can record that nigerians were like oh so apc want to turn nigeria to one party system this will not happen no people we are shouting don't set this country ablaze Oh, thank God that this has happened. Meanwhile, the candidates of the African Action Congress, AAC, in the 2019 and 2023 presidential elections, Omoyele Shuari has reacted to the Supreme Court of Nigeria, ruling on the Kanu State governorship election, affirming the election of Governor Haba Kabiri Yusuf. Shuari, a human rights activist and convener of Hashtag, Revolution Now said that the Appeals Court affirmed the election of Yusuf of the new Nigerian People's Party as Kano State Governor because the court traded the consequences of sacking him. They, they have affirmed Kano for NNPP, not because they wanted to, but because they traded the consequences, Shawari wrote on X, formerly Twitter. Sarah reporters earlier reported that the Supreme Court on Friday affirmed the election of Governor Yusuf, thereby reversing a sacking by the Appeal Court. The Appeal Court returned about 165,000 votes, deducted by the Appellate Court to the Governor. In September 2023, the election petition 
Tribunal in the state deducted 165,663 votes from Yusuf, total number of votes, and declared him as invalid. The tribunal said it was satisfied that the ballot papers of the affected votes were not stamped or signed. INEC had declared that Yusuf received 1 million. 19,602 votes to defeat Nasuru Gaona, who had 809,705 votes. The election petition tribunal in the state nullified the victory of Yusuf. In turn, the tribunal affirmed Nasiru Gawana of the All Progressive Congress, APC, as the duly elected governor of the state. The tribunal ruling was upheld by the Court of Appeal in November 2023, saying Yusuf was not qualified to contest the election. The governor proceeded to the Supreme Court to seek redress. Gano Gawuna had also questioned the NNPP membership of Yusuf, arguing that the party should not have sponsored his election for the election. Okay, guys, you... You've all heard it now. At least there is peace in the Canon State. The Supreme Court, they know. Yes, they know. What will be for Nigeria if they did not do the right thing? Congratulations to him once again. So, guys, what's your take on this? Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you.